Hello folks, uh, our uh, next question is uh, something like this. So it belongs to 2014-14, May, June, uh, paper 4-2, and the question number is uh, 9. So it's concerned with uh, iodine and water. Water. So it says that uh, some water becomes contaminated with uh, radioactive iodine-131. So it's given as 131I53, uh, or I can say 53I131. The activity of iodine-131 in 1 kg of water is uh, 460 BQ mackerel. So the initial activity we have is A naught. I can say it as it is a 460 mackerels. That means 460 particles per second. And the half life of uh, iodine is one uh, uh, is 8.1 days. So I can say uh, T 0.5 is equal to 8.1 days, not second, not hours. It is in form of days. So the first thing is uh, define radiative half life. You can do it yourself. Let me go to this part. So it says, uh, calculate the number of iodine 131 atoms in 1 kg of this water. So what we are given here is, the activity of iodine is given, there, the half-life is given, what we need to find is the number of iodine atoms are present there. So what we can have is, we have the equation, A is equal to lambda n, activity is equal to lambda into n. So this is the initial thing here. So I can say it as, uh, this is the initial activity, this is the initial number of atoms. And that is equal to, equal to 0 0.693 divided T 0 0.5 into N naught. So which gives me, which gives me N naught is equal to uh, A naught into T 0 0.5 divided, divided 0 0.693. So this will be equal to, let me put the values there, our A naught is equal to 400 into T 0 0.5 is equal to, it is given there, it is uh, uh, 8.1, 8.1 uh, divided, divided and this, uh, uh, this is 0 0.693 here, 0 0.693. But now what uh, we have a problem here is, this is in Becquerel, it is in uh, per second, per second and here we have got 8.1 days here. So we have to convert this thing into seconds, seconds. So when I do this in seconds, I will have one day will be equivalent to so it's not <coughs> so one day will be equivalent to uh, 86400 seconds it is uh, 24 into 60 into 60 so this will be equal to 400 so 8.1 days will be uh, equal to 8.1 into 86400 seconds so this will be this will be equal to so this will be equally equal to let me use the calculator so this will be equal to equal equal to uh, 460 I suppose, so I am writing wrong value here, this is 460 actually, so 460, 460 into 8.1 into uh, 86400 equal to divided 0.693, so this becomes equal to equal to 4.6454 into 10 to the power 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10 to the power 8. So number is equal to, equal to 4.65 into 10 to the power 8. So when I write it in 3 SF, it should be equal to 4.65 into 10 to the power 8. So here we have got 5, but it is 54 actually. So it is more than 5, that is why this thing will go up, uh, come, uh, this thing will go up and not down. So number is equal to, so number, the initial number is equal to uh, for iodine and this belongs to iodine here, iodine is equal to 4.65 into 10 to the power 8. I am writing it because I might write, uh, require it in future uh, calculations. So now, now uh, next question is, an amount of 1 mole of water has a mass of 18 grams. Of course, 1 mole has got 18 grams, so we all uh, should know. Uh, Student of this level should know that. We have to find the ratio of ratio of uh, number of molecules of water in 1 kg of water, number of molecules in 1 kg of water by number of atoms of iodine 131 in 1 kg. So we have to find the number of molecules of water 1 kg. That divided by this number will be the ratio. So first go for water. So in water, according to this given here, 18 gram of water, water should be equal to 6.023 into 10 to the power 23 molecules in grams. 
So I must have here. So this means or one kg or a thousand gram. Gram should be equal to six point zero two three into ten to the power twenty three into one thousand divided divided divided. It is eighteen. So this becomes equal to for what it's equal to six point zero two three exponent twenty three into one thousand divided eighteen. So this will be equal to three point three point three four six into ten to the power twenty five. So this is for water. So the ratio is equal to the ratio will be equal to three point three four six into ten to the power twenty five divided this thing here we have here four point six five into ten to the power eight and that will be equal to divided four point six five. Exponent eight equal to, so this becomes this becomes seven point one nine five nine into ten to the power sixteen. So the ratio will be equal to seven point two zero. So this I have rounded off here. So it goes here. It becomes zero. This becomes two into ten to the power sixteen. So this is the ratio of the number of molecules given. So ratio. Let's uh, write it here also. This ratio is equal to 7.20 into 10 to the power 16. Now the next question. Next question in the uh, next page here we have an acceptable limit for the activity of iodine 131 in water has been set as 170 becquerel per kg. So we have got one kg of uh, uh, water, one kg of water, and uh, the acceptable amount of activity is only this much. So this is. Uh, This is a. a is equal to 170 becquerel per kg. Uh, it is uh, some uh, some sort of health. Uh, uh, it has been set according to health point of view actually. Now calculate the time in days for the activity of the water to be reduced to this as well label. So we have to find the time. So the equation for this is a equal to a naught e to the power minus lambda t, lambda t. So if I take log, which we used in the derivation of this equation as well. So ln a by a naught is equal to minus lambda t minus lambda t. So I'll use uh, this equation here. So uh, we have ln is there. The activity here is 170. So it's 170. The initial one was uh, 460 actually. I have been writing 400 here. So it is uh, 460 equal to minus lambda is equal to 0.693 by By the time, uh, the half life. So it is 0.693 by the half life t 0.5, and that's equal to 8.1 once again, 8.1. And here, what uh, the question says is, we have to find the time in days, in days. So that's why I am using this uh, half life in days itself. I am not going to change it. So into 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 t. So this will give me. So this ln, this thing will be equal to shift ln. Sorry, sorry. Ah, uh, this is ln, ln one seventy divided four sixty equal to. So it's equal to minus zero point nine nine five four equal to minus zero point six nine three by eight point one into this t. So this will give me. So this divided, divided minus point six nine three equal to this much. And into 8.1 will be equal to yes. So this gives me this t equal to 11.635 days. Five days. So when I write it in a three SF, it will be equal to 11.6 days. So that will be the answers to this whole.